Donna Dodgson, January 24, 2019. I'm in Hanoi. And this is probably not the best place <laughs> to walk with a video camera. But I wanted to give an idea of how spectacular this place is. We're obviously right in the middle of the market. And I'll slowly walk around. There are motorbikes everywhere. I thought there were a lot of motorbikes in Chiang Mai, but they're amateurs compared with Hanoi. Everyone's on motorbikes. And they're getting ready to celebrate Vietnamese Lunar New Year, which is Tet. The most interesting thing I've seen are motorbikes with cherry blossoms on the back of them and kumquat trees. I'm told everything shuts down. This is all part of the New Year celebration where you give people money in envelopes. Red and gold is a very, very important color combination. Good luck. You see the lanterns here? The lanterns in the trees. Oh, this is just gorgeous. You can see it's misty. That's for two reasons. First of all, farmers are burning things and ready for spring planting. And secondly, it's raining, although not at the moment. Um, you can see people are wearing puffer jackets. They're cold. Well, I'm not cold. It's about 70 degrees, but when you live in the tropics, that's cold. And they do have a real spring. You can see the frangipani trees starting to bloom. Gardenias, dogwood, cherry blossoms. See them aiming straight at me. I am walking to the memorial um, to where the plane flown by the late great Senator McCain was shot down. Um, it's only 1.3 miles from my hotel, which was, I, I didn't know that until I, look at this, look at these blossoms. Okay, they're ready for this. So this is, this is like Advent around Christmas, when everyone is filling their houses with decorations. There we are, look at this. Look at these blossoms here. And here we have the kumquats over here. People are taking back home. On, I thought they were oranges. They look like oranges, but apparently they're not. They're kumquats. They will zoom in on them. what I would call a kumquat, but um, they call them kumquats, I'll call them kumquats. Look at them with happy pigs. Now the, currently it's the year of the pig, but next year it's going to be the year of the lamb. I haven't seen any lamb. Look at these, they're just gorgeous. have a, a winter here. We're only one and a half hours flight time from Chiang Mai. And the climate is very, very different. It's gorgeous. You can see a whole lot of buildings that were left from when the French were here. Look at these flowers. Oh my gosh, they're gorgeous. <laughs> get run over. They're very nice, but they're not running me over. And they have plastic flowers too. 
this is all. Okay, good luck, pig. I guess a pig is always good luck, no matter which year. Here we are, there's more of these kumquat trees. The people are carrying on the back of their... On the back of their bikes. That was the first thing I noticed on the motorbikes. It was yesterday, coming from the airport. Where people carrying these back on their bike. Well, you can see that people are carrying a lot of stuff on their bikes. Another thing that I, I noticed at the airport, oh, the airport itself is gorgeous. It's new. Um, it had at the front, there were, it's just new and glossy. Beautiful airport. Um, and the airport is expanding. This gorgeous road all the way to Hanoi. One thing I noticed at the airport was how much luggage people were bringing from Chiang Mai. Like four or five or six bags full of, full of stuff. So I imagine they can't get all the consumer stuff in Hanoi that they can that they can in um, in Thailand. Look at this, there's a mosque. So this is just looking back down the market. Just those gorgeous yellow lanterns. They're lovely. I think they do pet better than we do Christmas. I think uh, I like this. They're all in tent tins. All ready for people to carry back on their motorbikes. Okay. Susanna J. Dodgson, peacescientist.org, P-E-A-C-E-S-C-I-E-N-T-I-S-T-S.org, -E 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 in Hanoi, January 24th, 2019. Resist hate, resist oligarchs, impeach Trump. Division sucks. MAGA is all about division and I, re I reject division as my ancestors did in 1652 when they became Quakers. In, in resistance to the civil war that was fought poor people against poor people. Resist MAGA, resist hate, resist division.